Hey guys, Malachi here from Red Dank Roots. Today we're going to be talking about this little fella. This is the green tree frog. This is one of, if not the best pet amphibian for beginners. Today we're going to go over price, how to care for your frog, and why I think this is one of the best pet amphibians. These frogs are practically free. You could buy them at the store for $6. Now, from what I know, these are like the cheapest amphibians, and because they're such great pets, I would say they're absolutely worth it. Now, as far as enclosures go, that's up to you. I would recommend getting a 10-gallon terrarium, especially if you're going to have more than one tree frog, but you could probably get away with five. Anyways, you guys just do what works best for you. I got a 20-gallon because I thought, you know, more space the better. These frogs eat all sorts of things. They'll eat crickets, flies, mealworms, waxworms, pretty much every single kind of small bug. Now I'd feed these frogs mostly crickets once or twice per day. You can dust the crickets off with calcium powder, which is really healthy for your frog. Now I would miss their cage about twice a day and you don't really need a big water dish because um, they're mostly gonna be climbing around and they're not gonna spend too much time in the water. So for humidity, you wanna maintain around 60 to 65 and 70 to 75 at night. Now for temperature, you wanna maintain around 70 or 80 maybe a little bit cooler at night. For me, I have a simple little lamp here just to keep it bright. Then I also have a heat lamp, very low wattage, but just enough where it heats it up. I recommend a coconut fiber substrate because these are very tropical creatures and you're gonna be spraying a lot and you don't want your cage to get all moldy. For climbing, I would get lots of branches, um, vines, moss, and just a bunch of stuff that your frog can climb on or hide in. I really recommend getting like a small log or something. For me, I just put it up vertical. I just sanded it off and it was real. It looks really nice in my cage. These are really fun frogs, guys. And they're always jumping around. And if they're not, they're either sleeping or that. I wouldn't recommend this pet if you're looking for a good pet to hold, because as I just said, they jump around a lot. But these pets are fun to watch and I really recommend them if you're looking for a pet that is inexpensive and easy to care for. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and we'll see you next Friday. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and we'll see you. You just jumped really far. Oh.